Hey Wastelanders, this is Gary from The Last Ranger and I uh, recently bought a, a fixed blade and it's a SRK fixed blade that stands for self-reliant knives and this is uh, the first uh, first SRK knife that I bought and I believe it's the first release um, I, I think He's got a couple knives in the future. I believe uh, I heard about them on, well, I don't know if I heard about them. I, I think I heard about them on Big Red um, EDC's channel. Maybe, maybe a, eight months ago, maybe a year ago. And he was, uh, I don't know if Big Red actually got them in hand or he was just talking about them but i think i think he might have got them in hand before they had names there was at least two of them anyway i've been following srk for a while so i think i followed them before big red i heard big red um, um talk about them so um anyway i'm let's uh it's probably uh show you an unboxing sort of because i've i've not laid a hand, hands or eyes on this knife other than seeing pictures on the website so i got this knife yesterday and i haven't opened it i i took it out of the packaging and that's it so this is SRK uh, self-reliant knives, and this knife is made in America. I've uh, had a conversation with him. Uh, I tried to introduce him to Mattis Faction because they they live in Arizona and they live in the same town. So, and uh, hopefully, uh, Mattis Faction will um, interview him and have him in on, on his channel. So. I wish I lived in Arizona or lived closer to knife manufacturers. So this is, it says proudly May in the USA. And I've talked to him and he's, he does this uh, work out of his workshop, which is his garage. <laughs> so I'm going to support any people that are, American makers. Um, I, I really like uh, American companies. I I don't buy exclusively of exclusively American. I will like buy like Chinese knives or Russian knives. I buy knives that are look cool. But I always dig when I can support an American company, and I like fixed blades. So this is called the LeBlanc. And it's, uh, it's model was made in 32622. So it, it's, it just got released though. So blades, uh, two F I N I T. I don't know what that steel is. It's red micarta. It's supposedly it's, uh, the, the red micarta that I have on, a. What do you call it? I think it's a spicy micarta that uh, I have on a, another knife. Let me go find this knife. Okay, I'm back. This is a, the knife that I was trying to think of. The Jesse Giroux's, um Merlin. And I think it has the same micarta scales like this merlin it says i think it's a spicy some a chili chili pepper micarta chili pepper <laughs> not spicy chili pepper micarta so satin finish kydex sheath and the hardness is 59 to 60 and that's its signature selfreliantknives.com or self-reliant knives on Instagram 
I encourage you guys to check it out. So let's open this. It comes with a, a tech lock, sort of. It's probably, it's tech lock like, but it's probably not official tech lock. I don't. Anyway, it comes with um, some straps. There's various carry styles. There's a couple screws in there. And yeah, I, you can see I, I didn't open it. Let's get this box out of the way. So. Okay. So yeah, it's it's a little bit different uh, than this coloring, but uh, I believe it's called Chili Pepper Micarta, just the same as this. It's just a little bit different. This Chili uh, Chili Pepper Micarta, I have to uh, apply oil to to make it look this bright red, but luckily. Oh, okay. You guys like the look of it? it? Has a little bit of oil on the blade. I won't wipe that off because it's uh, on there to protect it. So, I like it. It has a, a black, black liners on the It's screwed on, so it's not pinned on. So I don't know if it's removable, and I probably won't remove it. But it's that's kind of nice that it's removable. I don't know if it's glued on and screwed on, glued and screwed. <laughs> I like it. I like the how it looks. I like the size of it. You can you can see it compared to uh, the Merlin and again this is the LeBlanc this this is the Matt LeBlanc from uh, friends <laughs> anyway it has the same uh, purchase of uh, a handle but uh, it comes with a really uh, handsome thin blade I'm, I'm more getting into like uh, fixed blades that I can pocket carry. For me, I would probably wouldn't use the. It's. I may have to work on this. Uh, work on this uh, Kydex sheath because uh, it's very tight. Very tight. <laughs> I guess it's better than ver being very loose, but it's. I'll probably have to contact him and see if I can. If I heat this up, maybe I could like uh, loosen it up. I don't like. Uh, uh, it's maybe getting better. Yeah, it's getting better. Maybe it was like me being a pussy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm used to like a. Uh, drawing nice out that are a little bit easier but let's compare it to a Nessie, another Jesse Jarrow's knife you can see it's a uh, that got the blade of uh, this size Jesse Jarrow's but it's a little bit uh, smaller handle but I like this and, and I pro forgot what I was saying oh I was saying I like to pocket carry knives fixed blades I would slip this in my pocket I probably wouldn't use the tech lock and I probably would slip this in the pocket and carry it this way because uh, I wear uh, BDUs and uh, BDUs have many pockets 
but I I used to carry a pocket carry, Mexican carry, uh, a 380. I still do, but I I I put I moved that to my bag, but uh, I I'm I'm mostly carrying knives, fixed blades in my pocket, my right pocket, and I don't know if I have a I can get a system to draw a knife from my pocket. Or I just have to like pull the knife out as is I, I pull the knife out and then I usually if it's kydex I'll just push the kydex off and use it like that so anyway let's uh, give you some size comparisons sorry you've probably seen it in my other videos I'm working on no sleep for like going on two days <laughs> This is uh, another pocket carry knife that I have. I usually carry this knife um, in my pocket too. I like this knife, by the way. It's very good handle, like a very good blade size too. I'm just showing you guys my pocket carry knife, pocket carry flex blades. I don't carry this in the pocket that much because it's it's it feels like a, a enormous. But I have another uh, GC that's kind of related to this size. I carry the GC, this, and this mostly, and I'll probably carry a uh, pocket carry this. This is a uh, feels like feels like a knife like this, like this. Yeah, I would. I would more I would like to switch over to like a fixed blade carry style I I've I, I really like pocket knives so yeah this is a fixed blade that I used to carry when I was a kid I keep meaning to do a review on it um, I, I used to carry this in my um, I always carry this in my sock <laughs> or a boot I used to when I uh, didn't have a boots on I would carry this in a sock it's kind of awkward but I made it do I mean when you're a kid you have long socks and I would carry this in a long sock this is a, a favorite of mine I've had ever since I was a kid it's like made by Tecna stainless steel Japan I don't know what stainless steel is or the what the is I don't know maybe it's 440 I don't know but it's held up over time it's a, a serrated knife but it's a I like the serration because it's they're practically unnoticeable on one side so I, th I believe this knife is uh, made for uh, the water diving I don't know the Tecna used to be red so that's it's very old for me consider I carried it as a kid <laughs> anyway I'll give you guys a review a, a full review of this I'll um, I'll do some cutting task with it I'll carry it a while and uh, look for it to show up on the channel eventually. I don't know. I'm, I, I recently got in so many knives I have to review them. But I'm really glad I got this. And uh, I believe this knife sold out. So I don't. I believe he'll probably release this knife in the future. But as is it's probably sold out right now so I like it I like the feel of it has a really good feel I love the blade yeah all right guys I'm gonna let you go and hopefully I'll get back to sleep or I'll get to some sleep 
but uh, I just wanted to show you guys a few knives that I got in so sorry about running long and I'll probably edit this down but take care Wastelanders Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack